Hey y'all, this is Deb and I've been tagged. I have four tags to do and I'm gonna try to get them done. They're gonna be out of order. So I'm gonna do the other tags. Y'all be patient with me. This tag is called the Biggest Fear Tag and I was tagged by Ebony Johnson here on YouTube. And if you are interested in my answers to this tag, please keep watching. Okay, my biggest fear, and I have a couple of fears, um, and, and what makes my flesh crawl are those real big outdoor tree roaches. Uh, in the summertime, they just like kind of try to, I don't know what they're looking for, but they'll try to come in your house if, you know, they'll, they're sneaky and I don't know how they get in, and then they fly. And when I tell you I'm so over and done with that, I, I, I just can't do those. I can't do them. I can't. I can't do them. I don't like them. I don't, I don't like them. They make my flesh crawl. I can't stand them. Um, it's either me or them. And if they're in the house, I'm out. Um, <laughs> another fear that I have is that, um, and it doesn't make my flesh crawl, but it's, it's one of those things like, hmm, I don't think my sons are, are going to ever leave. I think that they're gonna just like stay here with me like for the rest of my life I mean don't laugh y'all I'm, I'm for real for real um yeah I thought by now I would be empty nesting and the nest is still occupied <sighs> why am I afraid of these things um I've already went into detail about those tree roaches uh why am I afraid that my sons are not gonna ever leave because they show no interest in moving my oldest son will be 24 years old in December, and uh, um, yeah, he's not even talking about moving out. He may hint at it, and I get excited, and I say, "You can take the bedroom set that you that 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 you have in your room," and I start plotting and planning on giving him things. He said, "Well, mom, I'm just thinking about it." I mean, he shuts it down. I mean, literally shuts that idea down. And my youngest son went off to college. He wasn't real successful at that. Y'all, I had to bring him home. And he's just here. I mean, he's going back to school, but he's in my house. Yeah, I, I, I don't think they're gonna leave. I really don't. I get my house exterminated. And uh, the exterminator definitely treats, you know, around the perimeter of my house and the entrance into my house for those. But, so, I've uh, been very supportive of them and uh, I assist them. Uh, they both now have full-time jobs and they're both going to school still and working full-time and you know I'm encouraging things like um, you know showing them how to manage their money and do a budget so where they can see they can really afford to move out uh, maybe together and uh, split the cost and make sure that they're sufficient. I really don't want them out there before they're ready to go because then it means they may come back. But I'm doing things teaching them about money management and you know paying your bills first before you go have fun and partying with your friends and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, I need prayer. I would think some people would say to die alone, but I think a tragic death is uh, the worst way to die. You know, I know a couple of people that have died in car accidents or are lost loved ones in car accidents and I just can't imagine the excruciating pain that that to me and because I have this low tolerance for pain I think a tragic death something like a car accident or you know being murdered or whatever to me that would be like one of the worst ways to die for me I, I don't know it just seems it's just so heart-wrenching, so painful. It's so tragic for the person that died and as well as the family, so yeah. Now, I've been afraid of those big outdoor flying things like all of my life. You know, when I was a kid, my mom thought I was being dramatic. I am truly afraid of those things. Started having these fears about a year ago when they started coming back home and when I realized that away college going away to college wasn't for my youngest son uh, things started to sit in because I never had moments here alone at home to do whatever I want in my house by myself <laughs> I don't know y'all I love them to death but they are just very comfortable very very comfortable those are my fears 
I enjoyed doing this tag because it was quick. I'm being honest. I, I know y'all are going to laugh at me, but I am so serious. I don't know. You know, I'm just ready for, you know, them to go. I don't want them to leave too soon, but I want them to want to move out. Hope y'all enjoyed this tag. <laughs> I am going to tag a couple of people. Yeah, so if you all do the tag, I would love to see your answers. Please leave them in a link to your video in the comment section. I appreciate you all being patient with my tags because I love tags. And uh, yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments, suggestions, or concerns, leave them in the comment section. And until my next video, you guys be blessed. Bye. Take me away